check this out. I'm vlogging from the crib, back in Milwaukee. About to review my pop's new truck. He always gotta have one of them big boys. This is his new thing right here. It's about to get into the details. All right, here it is. Pop's new whip. So this, I believe, is a 2017 or 2016. Escalade ESV Platinum All the options Walk around See the big Transformers grill Big stupid grill Headlights Peep the detail See Caddy on the detail Yeah. Got every option, you feel me? Big 22 inch. Chrome and machine wheels. I really uh can't wait for him to get some bigger ones, but it's cool now. Uh, big presidential type link. Tail lights. Hey, this is one of the most player things about it. Watch this. That's so cold. I'm gonna show you that again. It's not gonna go up. Just gonna lock it home. Open it up, so we're gonna hop out. That's so cold, man. Hear that much start up. I think it's 420 horsepower or something like that. Sound crazy. All the options. I'm sure you got the Apple CarPlay, but got your Pandora, got the navigation, climate controls, heated cooling seats, everything. Yeah. So this little button right here is different though. You gotta go for the sport and the drag mode. It's kind of clean. Change the display layout. That's clean. Feel real presidential when I step down, you feel me? No, but this thing go crazy. Can I pop the hood on you? I'll pop the hood. Where the hood latch at? Boom. Real big boy V8 in here. I think it's like a 6.2, 6.4 liter? I don't know. But he is going, he told me he's going to let me do all the, the engine modifications. So unless he's trying to do a supercharger or something like that on here. I told him, cold air intake, tune, headers, full exhaust, and then he'll be good. Open this all the way up. But yeah, it look clean. It's clean now. Close that up, so you need to see. All right, let's check out the back seats real quick. My nephew, my little nephew, Carsey, he be in here. Now, from a Mustang owner's perspective, this is, you know, beautiful. Plenty of space. You got TV right here. Drop down TV right here. Let's see. Two TVs. TV right here. And then one more TV right here. Another drop down joint. This clean. Got the interior, sway all the way around. Got your source. Guess you can put your USB in right here. That's clutch. Where this let down to? Or just move around. Tilt it down so if you let the seats back, I guess. It's plenty of space. 
plenty space. Third row seats. Yeah, this joint go crazy. And this is actually a cooler. I was trying to hide my camera in here earlier today. He put me on game with this. But yes, yeah, it's cooler. Turn this on. Yeah, everything is dope. I tried to open up that little glove compartment. I don't even know how to open that up. Ain't no button or nothing on there. All this stuff is super new. The bowls, speakers, sound good. Wait for it. Boom, that's so clean. All right, so that's it for the Escalade review. What's next with this that I know of is that he gonna black out the emblems and then he gonna black out the wheels, but eventually he gonna put new wheels on there. He gonna let me pick those out too. 26s, 295s all the way around. Cause these is 285s in there right now, but 26s, 295s, and that'll close on the wheel gap. That'll be it, man. Can't wait to see it. Hopefully I get back out here sooner. Post another vlog on a little update. <laughs> and that's it, man. We out of here. Two things and pops with. One, the sunroof go crazy. I wish I had the full panoramic move, but you can't do that when you got two TVs in the joint. But one thing I really wanted to talk about, I forgot to, is this heads up display. You can't really see it, but I ain't no trucks had this. I thought this was a Camaro, just a regular Camaro thing, the Camaro SS. So then when you driving, see how many miles per hour we going? Who got they ball rolling down the street, bro? When you reverse, it show the top of the car, side of the car, so you see how close you are to the curb. Then the mirrors tilt down. And then when you backing up, the car like shaky when you get too close to somebody else. What? See, it just like reminds you right there. And if you keep going, it's gonna stop automatically. That's cold, bruh. Just in case niggas can't drive. I want to show y'all the heads up display, purple ball reverse camera, and then the alerters. 